Modular loading has several benefits. The, the key benefit is around improving animal welfare. We strive to continue to improve poultry welfare. Other benefits include productivity, a better quality bird, and importantly, improving uh, farm worker health and safety. One of the goals of Chicken Farmers of Ontario as we transition to the modular loading is to ensure that farmers have all the information available to them. We offer a wide range of uh, resources on our website for farmers to go to and see what needs to be done. But again, working closely with your processor is ultimately the way that uh, will be the seamless uh, transition to modular loading. We're here today to discuss the installation of the modular loading system at Farm Fresh Poultry in Harriston. Certainly the primary motivation was animal welfare. We've dealt with a lot of our growers uh, at Farm Fresh Poultry for years and years and years. We've been talking about modular loading with them for approximately four years before the installation happened. If we want to stay in business, it's an investment that we have to make in our future. We just simply cannot stay uh, with the old style crate system any longer. There are so many different styles of barns in Ontario. We've done everything from reinforcing a whole second floor from one end to the other with double floor joists. There's no one solution that everybody's going to force on a grower to make their barn ready for modules. We had an engineering report done for the for strength on the floor and because you have to uh, reinforce the floors, make bigger doors. Uh, um, you still have to chase birds uh, towards the margin, towards the door. When the catching crew comes here, they come in a heavy duty truck and they have a large enclosed trailer. That's where the loading equipment is housed when they come. Once the trucks get here, we, we back the trucks in and then we reduce the lighting so that they can get their fencing and push the birds to the outside and get loading them into the crates. It's three quarters of the time that it took uh, with the traditional loading. Basically a dresser drawer with stacks of crates. They just slide in and out and they load from the top down. The truck drivers really have to make sure that the, the modules stack properly. They're also making sure that the tarps are being dragged along as, uh, as well. In the end, it is, it is the right thing to do. It comes down to the main handling now. The wide open drawers for the modules, so you can get 300 birds into a module comfortably. Now, these modules are a lot better in the fact that they have a lot of space. If you look in between each drawer, there's a lot more space in between. So come summertime, the air is flowing through the, the modules. The mod system, um, it's made life a lot easier on them in terms of using the forklift, it's not as physical. The conveyors uh, and, and the sensors keep track of everything so there is no manual pushing. The drawers are wide open so it's really easy for our hangers to simply take a chicken and hang it on the line. It's very important between the CFIA regulations, uh, biosecurity at the farms, avian influenza, to make sure that all the, the trailer, the trucks, the tarps, modules, the drawers, the frame and the drawers both separately all get properly cleaned and then at the end of each process then there's a sanitizer that's sprayed on um, intended to disinfect. The board has been very supportive of moving towards modular systems. Uh, we've worked closely with the processing sector to develop uh, standards that will need to be met on farm. There's a few things farmers can do. First off, uh, most importantly, is talk to your processor. The processors have timelines, they have specifics. They'll likely come out to your, your farm and visit Every farm and really every barn is different and they can work with you to make sure that it's modular ready. Your fellow farmers, uh, there's farmers that have already transitioned to modular or are currently transitioning. They've done a lot of homework, they know what's practical and they can be a wealth of information. A third option and uh, an important one is to go to our website, ontariochicken.ca. I tend to go to the top right corner. There's a magnifying glass search, just type in modular, it'll take you to the resources and the page um, where that standard is posted as well as uh, questions and answers. Those will continue to evolve as we have more answers, um, but, but go there for current information.
All processors and farmers will move to be modular ready over the next few years, we predict. There are a few processors that have already achieved and are loading through modular systems. Others have uh, announced dates of when they're moving. And all of the major processors are discussing when they'll make this important transformation.